Yep, 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 yep. Yep, yep. Got him. That's food. Come on. Get in here. Oh! Do good, Smalley. We're eating that. We're eating that. That is food. That totally freaking counts. Did it say on? No! Yes, dude. We're getting this. We can't let this die. Look at this fire, dude. Dude, look at this. Yes! Food! Fire! Dude. No! We got fish. We got good fish. This is the live bluegill we just set out before we went to sleep. Yeah, dude. Yes! Dude, 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 look at this. Dude, we gotta get this guy. Dude, this is feast. No way. Dude, we gotta land this thing. No, not good. That is not what we're trying to eat for breakfast this morning. This is our home. Dude, there's a bee in front of the camera. What the hell? Already we're encountering li wildlife. This is our home for the next 24 hours starting now. Let me start the timer because we did just get on the island. 6.25 in the morning. 6.25. We just got on the island, so it is safe to start our 24 hours. I think we're actually going to be here more than 24 hours because I can't see myself leaving this place at 6 in the morning. I will be sleeping. Definitely. I know you can't see much, but the kayaks are parked up right here. And I do have a little crewmate tagging along with me today. He's going to be cooking the food, carrying all the stuff. No, I'm fine. I'm fine. We're both going to be. We're, we're in this trip together. It's going to be tough. I know I kind of just jumped right into this. I know that's what you guys like to see. That's what I like to do on the channel. I'm going to have to give you a tour on the island, but first we're going to need to set up this stuff. There's a little shelter. There's a tree falling down on it, so it's not very usable, but you can still use it. We're probably going to set up a tent. Let me unload these canoes. There's a ton of stuff in it. After that, I'll give you all the tour. We'll set up camp and we're gonna try and catch some breakfast because this is this is legit 24 hours. Like, I, we didn't bring food. We legit just don't, we don't have any food. This is gonna be quite the adventure. Never done this, something like this before. And welcome back. It's been a while since I've been in front of the camera again. This is going to be sick. Stay tuned. That actually took way too long. I know everybody says that, but we were complete noobs at setting that up. We probably put the Ron pole through the Ron hole at least three different times, um, but it is up. All right, so this is the game plan. We want to get at least one or two fish. It could be rock, the species we catch up here are like rock bass, bluegill. There's chain pickerel, there's bass. I don't want to eat a bass, but the game plan is <clears throat> to get some pan fish, first of all, to eat for breakfast. Later in the afternoon, we're definitely putting out a live bait. I'm not big on live bait, but when you're up north here and there's all these toothy species, you can't not do a live bait. So while we're chilling, maybe we'll get a catfish dinner, pike dinner, It'd be sick. But we're gonna catch fish for food right now. It's the morning, we need breakfast. Later in the afternoon, we're gonna do some fun fishing, try and get some bass, but this is the rig. It's pretty epic. I mean, it is what it is. We're surviving out here. Let's catch some fish, let's eat some food. It's been like two hours and I'm starving. <laughs> I'm legit starving. <laughs> we're so hungry. <laughs> This is actually a pretty stable canoe. I can stand in it, which is quite nice, especially if we're doing some fly fishing. This is actually going to be the key to our survival. Dude, this is the only reason we're going to eat today. <laughs> Follow the edge of this grass. We'll just get a rock bass to come out of here. Or a bluegill or some type of big pan fish. It's got to be at least the size of my hand if we're going to eat it though. That's a fish. <laughs> that don't count. Dude, what in the world? Hey, hold on. This is a start, baby. This is such a gorgeous fish, dude. It ain't much, especially for food. All right, buddy, I'll see you in another life. Get big, maybe I'll find you. Whoa, <laughs> maybe I'll find you next year. Peace out. Oh, so cute. All right, that's a start. Maybe fly fishing isn't the way to go for food? I'm sure, no, 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 no. That's not true, I lied. Fly fishing is definitely going to be a good way to get food. That's just one fish. It's been quick though, it's been like 10 minutes. It's a good sign. Oh, dude, see that hit? 
Yes, dude. We're in a fish vicinity. Dude. We gotta get in there. There's a school of fish. Yeah, that's a big school of fish. I was not expecting this. This is crazy. Oh my god, dude. Let's see a nice school of fish right there. Oh, I just got smoked. Oh, frick. I felt that, dude. Oh. Stop, 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 stop. Give me the fly rod. Yeah, he's interesting. Yep, 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 yep. Yep, yep. Got him. That's food. Come on. Get in here. Let's go, Mr. Rock Bass. Don't fail me now. Come on. Come on. Yes. Dude, does that count? I feel like that's edible. I can't believe that just happened. We were about to dip out. We gotta get this guy in the cooler. I think this definitely counts as food. It's a little thin, but I mean, we're starving. It's not quite the size of my hand. That's the problem. But it's it's got meat on it. That was funny. That was right when we were about to leave. We were about to go out to that island because I'm like, it's overcast. The fish gotta be off the bank. I see this guy swimming. I'm like, we're eating hens. This counts for sure. Dude, that's sick. He'll be our little taste subject. He's a little small, but we gotta put him out of his misery. It's time for the sad part. Give me that knife. I'm sorry. I don't normally kill fish, but 24 hours, eat to survive. This guy's definitely got some good meat on him. I'm put the knife right through the top of his head. All right, rest in peace. Yeah, he's dead. All right, that counts. Now we gotta do what's called bleeding them, which is cutting the gills so they don't, all the blood doesn't get into the meat. He's going in the cooler. Sorry, bud. All right, we're on the board. Fish bump me, baby. We got food. We got food. Now, we're still gonna be hungry if that's all we got, but it's a start. It's better than nothing. Lots of fish. Yep, fish on. We're on, boys. Well, this feels like a good fish. All this, oh! Dude, good Smalley. Good Smalley. Good Smalley. Dude, oh, dude! No way! Oh, I gotta loosen my drag. Oh my god, he's ripping, dude. No, it's too loose, it's too loose. Dude, stay on. No! Ah, dude. Ah, that was like a three pound Smalley. Is it, is it not ridiculous how much harder those things fight than largemouth? Okay. All right, let's retie. What the hell? That was such a good fish. He cut me off on a rock. I felt the rock. I felt the rock in everything. I don't think I would have had the heart to eat that guy. That's the problem. I think I would have released him, but it would have been so nice to catch him. RJ behind the camera would have ate that in an RP. Dang it, dude. What was I thinking? <laughs> Why am I whipping out the knife? I don't deserve to live after this, that heinous act, dude. How could I do such a thing? I thought I had eight pound fluorocarbon. I was kind of, I was low key getting a little bit scared. And I was like, I gotta loosen this drag up. Don't want to break off. I don't want him to take me in a plant and then I just break off. But he actually took me in the rocks because I had too loose of drag and then he, he broke me off. All right, we're getting on bass though. We're getting on bass though, and that counts. Oh, yep, that's him. Fish on. Oh, that's a rock, but he could still be on there. I don't feel him. One just freaking smoked it. I think I set the hook into a rock. Is he still on there? Dude, come on. Nah, he's definitely not on there. Frick! Dude, there is fish in this area. All right, so 
starting to rain, which is obviously not good because we don't have any dry firewood under any under, under any shelter. So if firewood gets wet, catching fish isn't a problem. Cooking the fish is a problem because we can't make a fire without dry wood. So we're rushing back to the to the island right now. We gotta get back. We gotta get dry firewood. Once we get fire, once we get wood under a dry spot, I'm gonna take the fly rod and the swim bait. I'm just gonna walk the wade the edge of the island and try and catch some more rock bass to fry up. But we have one. We have one. We have one fish right now. <laughs> we're kind of struggling, but we're gonna go try and cook them. We're gonna get some dry wood. We're gonna get some dry wood. We're gonna try and cook this fish up. We're gonna try and catch a couple more fish and then we are going to eat. If we eat one fish, that would stink, but it is food. It is food. We gotta get out of here. I gotta sit down. It's starting to rain pretty bad out here. Oh, it's starting to come down actually. Here, we gotta get this firewood, dude. Uh oh, we gotta move. Um, I got this bag. Can you grab my shoes? <laughs> oh, right, it's still pretty dry on the island. Oh, we made it to safe ground, but we gotta get this fire going. This has been a rough morning, low key. We're hungry, wet, and cold. Alright, so there's all this stuff right here which was hidden in plain sight. It's like perfect dry dead fern. Not fern, like pine, which is perfect. You can definitely use this. The rain's actually coming down harder than I thought it would today. I'm trying to work fast before it gets too wet. We have dry wood in storage, but we want to get this going before this fire pit gets soaked. Here we go. No, 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 not yet. I'm gonna blow from under it. Yes, dude. We're getting this. We can't let this die. All right, we're actually getting the fire started, which is really good. We're doing a lot better than we expected. And you get a lot more twigs, because right now it's just, it's Kindle keeping it going. Like I was saying, we need sticks. We need to get this dry sticks, because it's actually kind of pouring out. Good stuff. Dude, here you go. Nuts for that. Nuts for that. Let's go. All right, we gotta get this fire going. I'll update you guys once it's going well, but hopefully it goes well. Look at this fire, dude. This is gorgeous. Gorgeous. Time for me to put you guys down on this. I'm about to hook you guys up on this and we're gonna go wade the water, get a little wet, and find some, some more pan fish to fry. Anything right now, anything, I'll fry up and eat it. Gotta get something. So I'm gonna go wade the water in the rain, break out the fly rod, try and get some more pan fish to put in some oil and flour over the stove. All right, we're exploring this here island. Oh, dude, that was a good sized fish. Whatever it was, come back, come back, come back. That made a nice boil. That was a food one. Dude, that was one for the stove. Yep, there we go, that's a fish. That's a good fish, I think so. Oh, no, it's kind of small, what is it though? Oh, that's a white perch, we're eating that. We're eating that, that is food, that. Totally freaking counts. Yes. Okay, boys, <laughs> we got something. <laughs> we got something that swims. He's really small, but he's gonna be food and we are hungry out here. Dude, that counts. We're gonna put this guy out of his misery on a rock. I'm gonna censor this, but this is the easiest way to kill a fish. Easiest way to kill a fish. Thank you for your food. Thank you for your life. I appreciate you. Gotta do this hard, right? Three, two, one. All right, we got one. We got one, baby. Let's get some more here. That's another little filet. Maybe this rain is actually a blessing. We're gonna turn the fish on. Oh, yeah, there we go. That's bait, that's bait, that's bait, that's bait. Get that up there. Yes, yes! That is live bait right there. We actually, that's that guy's on the edge of eating, but we're using this guy for live bait. We're gonna risk it for the biscuit. We're gonna put this guy on a bigger hook Throw them out there and hopefully get some bigger food. No! Got him. Oh my gosh. Oh, I just had a heart attack. All right, we're heading back to camp. We got bait, we got two fish to eat. We're looking semi-good, especially if we can get 
a big fish on this. That would be insane. All right, we're gonna need to sprint this guy back. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> Let's go. Let's take this guy out on a little trip to what I like to call water. Man, he's down. Swim, buddy, swim. I know you can. Don't be faking that. I just saw you swimming. There he goes. All right, we're good. We're rock and rolling, baby. It's been a good morning for sure. Some game fish just for fun would be lit. Big pike could be on the board. Anything, dude, anything. I'm pumped. Two fish. We're gonna try our best to fillet this fish. I don't know how it's gonna go. We're gonna start on the small one first. And we're not gonna look up how to do this because that's lame. We're gonna try to, our best to do it. This is a survival challenge. There's no YouTube in, in, in the wildlife. We're gonna try and do this with little to no experience. Actually, no experience. Well, actually, little to no experience. I've kind of done this before. This one fish is so small, and I just happened to gut it like actually quite perfectly i'm not even finished yet so i think we're going to do the cross technique with this finish cutting off the fins and then eat this guy as a whole this boy is going in the frying pan this one can go on the grill we got like two different variations and we'll see how how it tastes clean cross cut fish first bit of food of the trip white perch baby We'll flip this guy over in probably about five minutes. And we are tasting fish number one soon, dude. I'm oh. so hungry. Dude, I'm so hungry. I'm so hungry. <laughs> it's such a tiny fish, but I'm so hungry. Dude, this actually looks good. Like, look how white the fish meat on that is. All right, give it like a minute. Honestly, I think it might be ready. Mm -hmm. Ready? Best of three or no? Uh, no. We're going straight up one. Rock, Rock, paper, paper scissors, scissors, shoot. shoot. No! Okay, mm -hmm. fine. All right, I'm kind of scared. This looks white, though. It looks good. <laughs> Bones. Mm. It's pretty good. It's actually delicious. It's so good. It's actually so good. Give me a bite. All right, first fish. I'm actually going to have to go with a, a success. I don't know. Scale of 1 to 10. Rate the fish. Me? Yeah. Um, I don't know. The bones kind of sucked. The bones suck. I'm gonna, give it, ten. I'm gonna give it a six. I feel like we could have done better. I feel like this is gonna be better. I feel like this fried is gonna be better. Alright, we're gonna eat this fish. We're not letting it go to waste. And then we're gonna fry up this next one. Oh, it's gonna be delicious. Fillets are inside here. Oil and seasoning is there. Toss them in. Fire is under there. Food! Fire! Fire power. Alright, uh, we're gonna let this thing fry up. It should only take about 30 more seconds. I gotta put this camera down. And when this stuff is fried up and in the bowl, I know that was a little bit of a time lapse, but I figured you guys didn't want to see me try and cut up a fish um, for 30 minutes. And we actually did quite well this time. Like, really well. This is frying up. I gotta put the camera down. I'll, I'll get you guys when we're eating. Trust me, I'll not eat without you. It's gonna be freaking delicious. Oh my god. Yes! Oh my god, dude. The, turkeys, the lone survivor. Dude! Oh my gosh. This is the moment we've all been waiting for. This stuff looks so freaking delicious, dude. All right, ready? Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Let's do it three. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, Rock paper, paper, scissors, scissors shoot. shoot. Yes! Nah. No, I'll try the small one. All right, all right, hold on. All right, you're gonna start with the small one? I'll, I'll share it, I'll share the love. All right, but go Ready? for it. This is probably taste so good. This is probably just fly out. That's so good. This looks like it's gonna be the best tasting fish I've ever had in my life. But we'll see. It's so good. We need to catch more fish. Dude, we- I will come out here and do an island trip every day if I can just eat this. Let me get a bite, let me get a It's so good. 
It's legit so good. Dude, let's catch more fish. Dude, we're... Oh my gosh. That tastes like it's from a restaurant. It tastes so good. That's so good. All right, so what is the time? It's 12.55, wow. We took like two hours to cook all that. We had fun when we were doing it. But that might have been the best, like one of the top five best fish I've ever had. Dude, that was that was the best fish. I've that ever. was so good, um, solely because it was fried and we put steak seasoning on it. We needed more. We need more. We need more seasoning. Breakfast turned into lunch. Yeah, we have a live bait sitting out there on a bluegill. It's been a lawn morning, like a really long morning. I'm pretty tired, but we're gonna take a nap. We're gonna get fishing on the kayak again. If we catch a bass, I don't care what we catch. We're bringing it back and we are frying it up and we are eating it. And then we'll spend the night here, maybe with a catfish for dinner. Still don't see the bobber, do you? But I think there's a fish on this. No Yeah, fish on. Yep. Yep. Yep, we got fish. We got good fish. He's not fighting back though, or do we just have grass? What do we have? Come on, please be a good fish, dude. Please don't be grass. I don't feel anything pulling back. Dude, I honestly think there's a fish on there. Or is that just the bluegill? Dude, I feel like there's a fish on there, dude. There's no way it would just, that fish would just make its way all the way down to some grass. There's gotta be, dude, please let there be a fish on here, dude. This is the live bluegill we just set out before we went to sleep. Not looking good actually. Wait a minute. Yeah, dude. There's a fish on there. Yeah, dude. Yes! Dude, 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 look at this. Look at this pickerel. Look at this pickerel. Dude, we gotta get this guy. Dude, this is feast. Dude. No way. Dude, we gotta land this thing. Oh, it's a bass. This is not a pickerel. It's like a two-pound bass. Ah, oh, come on. What is that bull crap? Especially look how thin he is. We're gonna give him this bluegill too. <laughs> That's sick though, dude. Look at that. Can't get away from the largies, can I? He's really thin. We're not gonna we're not gonna eat this guy. He he's been surviving. We're gonna give him a free meal. And I'll see y'all next time, dude. Yo, tell some dude, I thought he was a pickerel for sure. He's a survivor though, like we can't just it's a very pretty fish, just skinny, beat up. We don't wanna just eat him like that. That's messed up. Those would be good fillets though. Make sure he gets off. Mm. I want to keep my eye out because if he ends up not making it, that's food. All right, so I do, I'm a little crossed right now because I feel bad because I hate killing fish. But if he dies, I won't feel awful because that's a meal. I want to keep him in this area to see if he's actually going to make it or not. Because if he is, we'll let him go. But if he's not, this is a lot of food right here. I know that I know some of you are cross. I know half of you are like, eat him, eat him, eat him, eat him. Half of them are like, come on, help him. Let him go, let him go. And I'm, I'm torn because like, I'm starving, dude. We're so hungry here. I've had like two fried fish nuggets. Is he trying to, he's trying to throw it up. Look. Oh my God, dude. He's got Sankos all down his gullet. Hold on a second. Look at this. He's gagging it up. He's throwing it up. Dude. Gag it, bro. Throw it up, bro. Come on. Is it oh. Holy crap. One, two. <laughs> All right, now we'll give him one more chance. We'll give him one more chance. We just pulled a bluegill and two sankos from his mouth. That's insane. That's crazy. He just didn't even swim off? That's lunch, dude. I'm sorry, but I mean, we caught him. He died, but we caught him. <laughs> Last thing I wanted to eat, but food is food, and we are eating him because we're hungry, and he'd die if we released him. And that's in fact, I promise you. A little PM fishing sesh. 
All right, let's run it back, baby, for the second time. Now, we're off to a really good start. We got our, our lunch dinner type deal. We'll see how it goes, but I'm feeling good. I want to catch some game fish, catch fish for fun, catch some smallies or something. We'll see. We're probably going to go change it up and go in between the islands and search that way. That's what I feel like. I feel like we can find some sick fish that way. If not, we'll go back to the trusty island rock thing out deep. But we'll see. All right, we are venturing to the other island. This is the smaller island, but it's right next to the other one. We have not fished it yet. We're going for more predatory fish. I don't throw a swim bait, but jerk bait seems to get it done all the time. It's a little choppy out here too, and cloudy and overcast. Jerk bait should do the freaking trick. That's a fish. Oh, yes. Stay on. Stay on. Dude, in between the islands, I knew there had to be fish here. A little smally. Let's go, dude. That's sick. Smallmouth. That's the first one of the day that we landed. We're not going to eat this guy. We already have a humongous largey on our hands. But we're pretty full, and I don't even like eating bass in the first place, unless they died like that one. Let them go and let them grow. I'll see you, Smalley. I'll come back for you next year on this 24-hour challenge. Peace out. Oh, he actually did 360. Fire, warmth, cooked food. Strong man breaks stick. Strong man, breaks Strong man stick. throws stick into flame. Ah. Little man touch flame. Ah. Holy dude, good stuff. Look at this. This is sick. Well, that is a fire. If I've ever seen one. I was about to just throw the light. Yeah, let's not do that. Let's not do that. <laughs> All right, so while we're at a good spot in time right now, we got a fire. I think we ought to check the weather. Because it does look like it's going to storm. And that's 66 in a drizzle. So right now it says it's raining and 70% chance of rain, which is only going to drop in the near future. 5 a.m., 60%. 6 a.m., 70%. 7 a.m., 70%. 8 a.m. So we're probably going to wake up to rain. All right, beautiful bass nuggets. I'm gonna push these things on the fryer. The pan with oil and seasoning. Right, my bass nuggies get fried. It's getting rainy, it's getting dark. I need to eat this and I need to lay in the tent. I'm gonna do a quick review on the bass. And I gotta get in the tent and get a little warm. It's been a long day. All right, not the not the result we were exactly looking for. This one came out looking more like soup. I don't think the oil was hot enough when we put it in. I think that was the problem, but we're still gonna give it a try. Whoa. I don't know why, why, why it didn't like crisp up as much this time. I think the pan just was not hot enough. Mmm. That's delicious, dude. That's so unbelievably good. It's insane. It's insane how good this is. It's more of like a mush, but... Oh. Yeah, we worked hard for this meal, too. It feels so good. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna enjoy this meal. It's pretty darn good. I'm gonna look at this rainy lake and eat fish. I'm gonna get a full belly, and I'm gonna make a game plan. But we'll see. How much time we got left of this 24 hour challenge? 5.45, it's been about 12 hours. So we got till night, sleep, and we're done. That's insane. All right, I'm gonna eat the rest of this fish. Bass is pretty good. First ever bass, it's crazy. All right, gents, as you can see, <laughs> it's pitch black. It was a little bit of a scene switch. I couldn't film much in between those last couple bites of that bass and now because it started dumping rain. It's still pouring right now. It's only like 8 o'clock, but we're snuggled up into our sleeping bags and we're probably gonna, probably gonna hit the hay, go to sleep. 8.37.
pretty early, but it's a long day. I'm pretty hungry. The sooner we go to sleep, the sooner we can wake up and go eat something like oatmeal and coffee or tea. Cookies, baby. I'll see y'all in the morning. Eight forty. That's twenty six hours, and also, it is unbelievably foggy. There's so much condensation. You guys are blurring up right now. Look in the background. The white sky is just so foggy, dude. It's insane. It's pretty much a swamp out right now. I'm not gonna talk too much. I'll get some shots of us loading up, but that's twenty four hours. It would be nice to uh, make a breakfast here this morning, but I'm sick of fish. I need to get back to civilization and eat something real. <laughs> Not just fish. If I eat one more fish, I think I'm gonna throw up. <laughs>